Uh, no, Doc's taking a look at it right now, and um, there was a, on the video, it was, uh, you know, she was going through the lane and trying to get from here to there, and somebody on the other team, I think, just kind of bumped, tweaked it a little bit. I guess they'll know more, you know, after they look at it more in depth. But par for the course. We, we, we didn't have the energy um, to get us through some of the, uh, you know, the missed shots. You know, you say, well, why did – we missed a lot of shots in the first, first quarter, first half. Like, why? Um, you know, they were pretty decent shots. They just didn't go in. But we didn't bring enough energy. Like, we didn't go chase them either. Like, we didn't – you know, like some games, you know, we'll go and get 15, 17 offensive rebounds and make up for some of those misses. It just kind of settled – it settled into a, you know, kind of a ugly scrum kind of game, you know, where, you know, we just couldn't get any kind of – any kind of flow. You know, we tried to speed it up as much as we could. Um, you know, we wanted to pick up more full court, but then all of a sudden, you know, you can't. Just don't have enough bodies. We got a game Tuesday. It's just too much. So we we had to kind of settle for some of that. Um, and in the second half, we just made it pretty simple. You know, you guys stand there, stand here, stand here, and stand there. And Aliyah and Dorka, you guys stand in that spot over there, and we're going to throw it to you every time down the floor. And then let's go. Home. And that's basically what we did. Well, I hope from her. I don't think it comes from anywhere else. Um, you know, I think you get to a certain age, you should expect some things from yourself that are a little bit different than before. Um, you know, we talk about that a lot in our program. You know, act your age. Play your age. You know, so if you're a freshman, you know, you're not expected to play like a senior. But if you're a freshman here at UConn, you can't play like you're in, in high school either. So by that same token, if you're a senior at Connecticut and you played a lot of basketball, we can't be worried about you. I, I, I can worry about a lot of things, but not you. So, you, you know, Leah, Dorka, but, you know, Leah, comes a point where, you know, you're going to stay the same and be whatever you are for good, or you're gonna you're gonna change, and you're gonna become something more. And every kid has to make that decision, really. You know, um, some kids don't make that decision. They just see how hard it is to become something more, and they don't want any part of it. You know, Leah's put in the work. You know, and she's getting the benefits out of it. The confidence that she's gotten is probably the biggest thing. She's playing with more confidence when it comes to how your team looks and how you're playing and how your players are developing and all that. Um, and everybody, you know, with the injuries, you just start to you just start to think that you personally are responsible for all of it. And I don't think I don't think that's healthy either. I don't think you can be like that. So, yeah, there were a couple times in the first half today. I said to CD, and actually she wasn't happy, and Morgan was uh, Jamel wasn't happy. You know, I said if I was a big guy, I wouldn't come to Connecticut unless you want to learn how to get your shot blocked and miss layups. And you know, they're like so much for the new you. <laughs> I told Jamel I was turning over a new leaf. She said, Coach, since I've been here, you've turned over trees. <laughs> um, 
Well, you know, when the, the Paul game was canceled, postponed, because, you know, you have to have seven healthy scholarship players. Nobody said whether they had to be any good or not. So I think we're going to have to put an addendum into that contract. <laughs> um, but yeah, you want to use these guys, you know, like you, you want to give them opportunities out on the floor and you just want them to be like solid, like not great. You know, they don't have to be great. They just got to be solid, you know, and um, for some of them, it's a struggle to do that. And I don't get it. So, yeah, it does feel like sometimes. And, you know, you want to give some of these guys a rest with all the games we have coming up the next two weeks. Um, so hopefully, you know, with a little bit more work, these guys can give us a couple productive minutes, you know, use all our timeouts more, you know. But, yeah, if, like, if AZ's out any period of time, like if she doesn't play Tuesday, we're right back to square one, right? You know? Waiting on, you know, waiting on, on Caroline. Easy, easy. We'll step out for a week, and Caroline will come back. <laughs>